Say hi to these Pioneer fans. Turn the sign. There you go. The Mustangs take the lead early. Ethan Stanton just kills this one, sending it all the way to the wall in right center. One bounce over the fence. It's a ground rule double. Then with Stanton at third, Ryan Perry shoots it the other way. A nice piece of hitting there to score Stanton as the throw home is cut off. one nothing Mustangs after two. Same score in the third, one out for Steven Contreras, who knocks a solid single to center. Scoring is Mike Simonini. What a great athletic career for the senior at Pioneer. The Mustangs looking for more. It's a shot back up the box, but a nice play by the pitcher, Ryan Gorman, to end the fourth. Still 2-0, Pioneer in the lead. The Mustangs keep it that way with a fine play by third baseman Steven Contreras. 2-0, and we go to the sixth inning. But it was a magical sixth inning for the Titans. One on for Jake Verhulp, who crushes this one high and deep into the gap. And Jake is running. Ryan Gorman scores. It's a triple for Verhulp. The Titans tie the score on this Ryan Taranishi line shot to right. And we are tied at 2 all. Still in the sixth, and this just should not happen to the home team. It's a bad hop single pass short from Matt Sandor. Scoring is Taranishi, and that's the winning run. As Gunn hangs on, the Titans talking with the San Jose Earth Earthquakes, Evan Newton after the game. How you guys doing? I'm Evan Newton with the San Jose Earthquakes. I'm here with the Gun Titans after their first round playoff victory over Pioneer. Congratulations. Yeah. I'm here with senior Graham Fisher. How does it feel to get the first round victory, you know, against Pioneer at their, you know, away at their place? Oh, it feels great because this is our first time when I, well, at least when all, all of us seniors have been here, that it's our first playoff game and it just feels good to get it one for the school. It oh. feels really good. For sure. That's awesome. And then I'm here with pitcher Ryan Gorman. And you went all seven innings, went the whole game. Yep. So um, a little stamina there from you. How did it feel, how did it feel to get the, get the W? Oh, man, that felt really good. Uh, had a few... Uh, Tough innings there in the beginning, let up a few hits, but you know, we really came together as a team, got the defense working, and really pulled through there in the end, so pretty happy about that. Next up, we have Jake Verholt, hit the big triple to get the team back in the game. You know, what was going through your mind there when you are at bat? It felt great. I was just uh, trying to put the ball in the gap, get a little something going. Uh, teammates picked me up, we uh, got ahead, and we didn't relinquish the lead, so yeah, it was good. Lastly, I'm here with Ryan Taranishi, another senior. Um, how does it feel that to, to win you guys' league, and, and, and what do you think your, your coaching staff has, how, how have they helped you know, the team get through the season? It feels great. Uh, we've got a great group of guys here, and uh, first time we won the league in uh, 12 years. So uh, it's our collective effort, and our coaches, uh, they just made us work hard and put in the work, and that's what it is. Thanks for tuning in, guys. Again, I'm Evan Newton with the San Jose Earthquakes. Make sure to come out and check out our next home game. Again, congratulations to the Gun Titans on their first-round playoff victory. And uh, good luck to them in the in the near future. Eyes on three, eyes on three. One, two, 